Haley Baldwin reveals how the 2016 election divided the Baldwin family. The 2016 election created a major divide within the Baldwin family. Alec Baldwin, who has famously impersonated Donald Trump on Saturday Night Live since the election, and his Trump-supporting brother, Stephen, have publicly disagreed on their politics in the past, but the disagreement over the contentious 2016 election had an even deeper impact on the famous family than previously realized. Haley Baldwin, Stephen's model daughter, recently opened up to the Sunday Times about how Trump's victory over Hillary Clinton affected her family, and how they were eventually able to move past their differing views. That was a very hurtful situation for me. I love my father, he's an amazing dad, but we so strongly disagreed on, the election, Haley, who voted for Clinton, said. He and my sister strongly disagreed on it. My sister's husband, like everyone on our side, just doesn't agree with him. We don't talk about it now. It's not worth the argument. Haley went on to explain that she thinks the division in both her family and the country at large will ultimately be beneficial to society in encouraging younger generations to be outspoken and politically engaged. The star went to the March for Our Lives in Washington, D.C., earlier this year with pals Kendall Jenner and Jaden Smith. Everything that's happening in the world is so crazy, but if any positivity is coming out of it, it's teaching young people to stand up and be vocal, the Instagram superstar added. We're the next generation who have the access and power and we have a lot of drive. I've been trying to find ways to get more involved with people my age and make changes for things that matter. As mentioned above, Haley's big reveal about her family isn't the first insight into the political divide between her relatives. Alec has been an outspoken Trump critic for years, while Stephen has been a vocal supporter of the president, too. In fact, the actor went so far as to urge his brother to retire his impression of Trump before he even won the election. Well. Alex, got the voice down very well. I think it's getting a little too nasty right now, said to CBS News. I don't want to be a party pooper here, but I don't think it's very funny. I don't think there's anything funny about this election. 